Let's take a look at the Windows 11 countdown timers. And you can get there by going to the Start button. And then you can click on Clock. Now, if you don't see Clock, you can just go ahead and type Clock in the list. And you can click Open. Now, once Clock is up, we have this option here for Timer. And when you click on Timer, it shows multiple different timers that you see here. So, for instance, if I want to choose the One Minute Timer, I can click on it and I can change it if I'd like by making it more, say you make it two minutes. I can even make it less. I can change the amount of seconds as well. Click Save and I'm ready to do the actual countdown. All I got to do is click the play button or the triangle. Now when it's all done, I can hit the reset if I want or I can do it at any point and it'll just start over again. If I want to make a new timer, I can go down to the plus and I can add a new timer that you see here and I can give it a name. So we'll call this one timer two minutes and I'll click the plus, click save. And now I have a two minute timer. And you can see I didn't actually change the time on it. So I'll go back and click and click save. Now it's saved for two minutes. Now you can see my one minute and one second timer is almost up. Let's see what that happens uh, when that gets to the bottom. And there we go. And we're at zero. And we can see a little pop-up happens that the timer is done. And if you have your sound turned on, you'll also hear a beep as well. And that is how we use timers in Windows 11.